What's going on all you beautiful people? My name is Tokushi and welcome back to another Minecraft episode. And guys, luck has finally struck for me. And you can't really see much right now. Um, it's just over in the, the um, mountain area right now. I uh, mean, there's pretty little waterfall coming down. Um, it's not to mark where it is, but I have to... Sh I was so happy when I saw this and for a while. I've just been looking for one, looking for one, looking for one. And this I only happened to come across by chance I went looking for cows over here. But uh, as I was looking for cows, now you can start to see a little bit, there's cobblestone. Yes, I found myself a dungeon. Now I haven't, I know it's a uh, skeleton dungeon, that's all I know. Kind of treacherous for it to be up here. But I have not looked in the, in the um, chests yet. So let's just disable it now. And uh, really lucky it's a skeleton spawner, you know, first one being a skeleton spawner. And let's see uh, ingots, cocoa beans, bread, cell, so and ingots, buckets. Okay. Um, yeah, really lucky it's a skeleton spawner, and lots of gunpowder, and another saddle. It's so I can get, uh, bones to grow stuff quicker, and, um, arrows, so it'll be really nice to have. So, so, my, my first spawner on this world, and I'm very proud of it, well, yeah, proud, happy that I found it. I was just walking, like I said, I was just walking around over here and looking for cows, and I just happened to walk up this mountainside, and I looked over, and I'm like, what's cobblestone doing there? I didn't do that. Um, yes, it's uh, a dungeon. Um, so, it's pretty far out, well, not really that, well, it's a bit of a walk, but once I put rail trail, rail trail, yeah. Um, minecart tracks out here mm. uh, it won't be that long of a trip so that's going to be a project that's soon to come next thing you can see I got to level 30 which is great so we're also going to do that today we're also going to enchant a new diamond pickaxe I just kind of enchanted these with like a little level 1 stuff well that was already enchanted um, oh, yeah, there, and I had that. I chanted that with, like, a level 2, and that was lucky. I'm breaking 1 and efficiency 1, which is, uh, also what the other plan for today is going to be. I'm going to dig out the area where the sheep are going to be going, I think. Um, but I did have another idea for the whole sheep thing. I'm going to try and expand, this isn't the idea by the way, but I'm going to try and expand what, how big the pens are. Um, I'm thinking a 5x5 five five is going to be a little bit too small. So, uh, I'm going to work with that. But uh, that area over by the chickens, I have a plan for that now. That little um, pen-like area where I said I was going to store some cows. Well, I didn't store the cows there. I do need to find a place to store my cows now. I got like a bunch of them. And what is this, Minesy? Oops, the zombies are found. As long as they're not running fast. I really can't wait till I get internet back. Then I'll be able to uh, play some Minesy. Record it. And, you know, I realized this the other night when I was playing, or, well, actually, no, earlier today when I was playing. It looks really nice from down here. Sure nothing's gonna try and attack me here. It looks really nice from down here. It kind of looks like a fortress area. You guys just, just all, like, built up up here, and then you get the little stairway leading to the fortress. So I'm figuring in the future, I mean, you got the house here. I'm figuring in the future, I also want to build, like, a tower right here. So when you walk up here, it's like, real majestic and nice looking 
I think I might um, make that my mob power system. Okay. We'll just get ourselves up there. This really sucks. My uh, diamond sword's about to die. I did find some diamonds today. I kind of act accidentally. I'm trying to plan for this plan for this episode and get prepared for this episode. I fell down to, into another uh, ravine. I didn't fall down in there. I fell upon it, but yeah, yeah, yeah it's real annoying. I got lots of lots of sheep and random cows. But, uh, house here. That's it for a while that. I'm going to sleep real quick. And ready pie. And good morning. Okay. So really excited. Level 30. My first level 30. And it's gonna be great. Ready? Fortune 3. Oh wow I'm very happy about that. Uh, Fortune 3, Efficiency 4, um, nonetheless. So that's really awesome. And just for good measures. Um, I guess that's something else I want to do first. Let's find my iron helmet, it's almost dead. But only a freaking bone. I'm level one. I think I'll just um no I don't wanna enchant that. Probably best to enchant chest piece. Um duh. I'm having a moment guys, just bear with me. There. Level one. Blast protection. I seem to get blown up by creepers a lot. Not gonna lie. Alright. Let's throw something in there and test to make sure it's all clear. Yep, level 30. Alright. So, like I said on the agenda for today, uh, I think I'm just gonna start working on the, um, idea I had and see how well that works out. Oh, that's this is just bothering me all the time how right there. So I have a uh, kind of serious topic I want to talk about. We're getting back into um, school time in my area, which brings up you know stuff from my past. And I was talking about this with somebody I work with. She said that her daughter uh, didn't want to go back to school, and has always terrified of not wanting to go to school and you know, um, I'd rather not go to school, and it's a shame to hear, you know, stuff like that, and kids should want to go to school, um, she's 13, I think, and, uh, it's, it's a pity when a child doesn't want to go to school, you know, um, the reason being, and this is horrible, this is kind of like a plea, um, from me, I really, I'm, I mean, I'm not that popular or anything, but, um, kind of a plea on my behalf, you know, what I went through, but, um, the reason she doesn't want to go to school is because she's bullied, and understandably enough, I wouldn't want to go to school either. Um, I was bullied in school, and there was days where I did not want to go to school. Um, 
my best way of, you know, trying to help. This is just my personal experience and my my uh, words. Two bullies themselves. Um, but pretty much bullying. It's it's good. It's horrible. It's not. It's not right, it's horrible, and people are getting hurt so much every day from bullies that children are, and it, children have now been causing, or committing suicide because of it, and that's not right, in my opinion. Um, it's, it's heartbreaking when a child commits suicide, or really anyone, but more so a child. Um, in school, I was bullied a lot, and my way of dealing with it wasn't necessarily the right way, but, I mean, it got the job done, and um, people eventually left me alone. I guess that's the good side of it. But really, not everybody can do what I did. My way of dealing with it was to fight, just to fight them, and just, you know, Eventually, after beating numerous kids and hurting numerous kids, I, you know, most people left me alone. But it's not the answer. Violence is not the answer. It's definitely a last resort. If you're being bullied, please go tell someone, go tell a teacher, go tell your principal. And if none of that works, which in my friend's daughter's case, it, it um it wasn't helping. She was tell she told the principal. Her mother went to the principal, and her she didn't do anything, or the principal didn't do anything, and that's horrible. I mean, this isn't this isn't the kind of stuff that um you want to see happen. And the fact of the matter is, it's happening all over the place, and a lot of the times it's not being stopped, and people are committing children are committing suicide. Um. I'm not really, I, I really hate this topic because it's heartbreaking. And, um, yeah, the principal's just not doing anything. Now, right here, I'm trying to figure out what I want to do. If I want to do it in stairs or if I want to do it in half slabs. I think it's probably going to be better to do it in stairs half slabs. I mean, half slabs look better. But, um, as you can see, I'm trying to start a, trying to make a stairwell going down. But, um, yeah, it should. It's, it's horrible. Or if a friend of yours is being bullied, help, help them. But, um, Definitely, if you're being bullied or somebody you know is being bullied, stick up for yourselves. Don't let it happen. Do something. Go to whoever you can. And my best, my best advice is if nobody else is listening, no teachers, no, the principal's not listening, then go to the superintendent. If that even doesn't work, um, go to the police. And I know a lot of people don't, or a lot of places don't have uh, laws against bullying yet, which is horrible to think as well. Oh, how am I doing this? Um, but do something. That's all I can really say. Um, the next part of this discussion is parents. Bullying is a lot worse nowadays. Now, children can't even get away from it in their own home at times. And um, that's the truth because now there's um, cyberbullying. And I know this may be news to a lot of people, but the internet um, really has many ways of hurting people. If um, 
bullies have a way to access your child or, you know, whoever is being bullied or whatever. Or whoever is being bullied, yeah. Um, they're going to use it. Facebook, uh, bullies have made videos and posted them on YouTube to embarrass the, their target. Um, Twitter, any social media is just, is really horrible nowadays because, I mean, it's, it's great that we have ways to connect, but it's bad that people are using it for the way they are. Um, I'm deeply saddened by all this, and when I heard that my friend's daughter didn't want to go to school, I was just like, phew, this is crazy. You know, this shouldn't happen. You know, I'm not doing this the way I want to. Um, first off, this one has to be changed. This can't be grass up here. Or it might stay grass, I don't know. Hmm. Even there is there's even actually a movie out there that ABC Family had uh, done called Cyberbullying or Cyber Cyberbully. Yeah, that's it. And it really shows the the nature that bullying bullying has. What can happen and uh, how how it can turn out. So please, if you know somebody who is being bullied, if you are a bully, stop it. Put a stop to it. Bullies, would you really have, like, would you really like to have the, uh, the thought for the rest of your lives that you practically killed someone? Do you really want that weight on your shoulders? I know I wouldn't. The death of somebody is not to be taken lightly. Yet a lot of people are acting like it's a whole huge joke. Please. That's all I have to say. Stop bullying. This world has enough problems. So, um, well, I got that off my chest, and it's not so crazy. going down I don't really like. Probably should have tried using half slides. Hey, there's a Oh, that was great. Good thing that wasn't any further down. That would have really hurt a bit. Darn, 
I'm so used to having. Well, actually, not really. Also, I'm so used to having my uh, pickaxe right there. What? Oh, darn. Well, that's not as bad as it should be. Or it could have been, rather. Alright, guy. You want to do it this way? I'm just going to go ahead and dig out this area right here. See if I can't figure out how I'm going to work the rest of this. I thought I had it figured out, but I guess I was wrong. a bit of a drop. So, um, sorry for delaying videos lately, if anyone really has noticed. Last couple of weeks have been a little crazy. And I've been playing lots of Call of Duty. I was actually, unfortunately, uh, hit with a, um, like a hacked client or something. The guy, it was a some kind of hack where people use it to get to level 70 and only hit one shot in Modern Warfare 2. So, um, I ended up jumping into one, a game that had that hacked client thing. Or whatever, and I ended up killing someone and jumping up all the way up to level 70. So, unfortunately, I didn't work my way up to it, but I guess now that I'm there, I just really can't complain. I got all everything unlocked, except now I guess I just need to go for prestige mode. I got every, all these guys shooting at me. Where are you? Let's not look at them guys. Alright, I thought I saw somebody shoot at me again. I think I'm doing this right. No, that definitely wasn't right though. I knew he was right, right next to me. Oh, um, another other news. Uh, Pokemon. My Pokemon uh, Nuzlocke challenge. Uh, I realized my last video after I posted it didn't have audio synced up. Um, I'm really sorry for anyone who uh, watches both of my videos and uh, realized that. I don't like that stuff happening, but sometimes you just um, don't notice something and then there's really nothing you can do about it, and I didn't really want to take the video down, so um, other than that, I really don't know what else to say, except, uh, sorry, accident happened. And I think we've got this here. The only only thing now is I just have to make it look better.
And I can do that. I'll have to throw in all this. Fill this all in with a, with a special stone here. And light it up a little bit. Do some pretty neat things. Maybe I could throw some redstone in somewhere. We haven't got to see me use redstone yet. Ah, oh, yeah, guy. So, um. Alright, guys, that's the episode. Uh, to recap, uh, found a uh, skeleton spawner. Really happy about that. Um, had this brilliant idea of the stairway here. We're just gonna. We'll have that stairway. And then be able to just kind of walk out down here. And voila! On dice way right through into my sheep area and uh, the bullying topic guys I'm serious about this this stuff shouldn't happen um, bullying is really serious and I really pray that anybody who knows somebody who is being bullied or is being bullied or is even maybe a bully themselves do something about it stop it excuse me I realize I screwed up here, so please guys, we need to get this, we need to get this figured out, it needs all to stop, so, hey guys, I'll catch you next episode, um, keep an eye out for, uh, what am I thinking, keep an eye out for my Pokemon series, my Pokemon Nuzlocke Challenge series, and I'll see you all later.